Okay, I'm back. And what I'm doing here today is I'm taking the engine and the transmission out of this Ford Escape. Now, I know there's a hydraulic engine hoist you can get, but, you know, if you're home and you don't have one of those, all you need is some timbers. You know, these ones here are about 11 feet long. You just got to make sure that the tops uh, protrude above where you're going to tie the chain on it. So you just put a chain around there, preferably one that has a, a grab, you know, that'll go over the, the link, like that one there. Grab back on itself, and then the rest is just wrapped around. I put it on, when I had it on the ground, I had the three of them laid out here, and I put a loose loop there. It was probably about a, you know, a foot of slack in it, so that it had a helper help me pick it up, and we kept the legs spread as it went up, and that prevents the chain from sliding down. And uh, so once you've got that up there, you got it in position, just the legs sitting on the mud there, that's gonna hold the weight of it. We got it in three spots. Uh, initially, what I was trying to do was put one of the legs down in b behind here, but I realized it was uh, it was too close. It wasn't going to get over the engine, and I just got a chain block on there, and I've got uh, hooked on one lift here. I think one lift will do the whole thing. Uh, I didn't see a second lifting point on this, and I think it's okay. So what I had to do was just disconnect uh, the upper part of this motor mount from the frame. And this one, I just took a bolt out of here. And uh, so it's free now. So we're gonna try and lift it up. And there it comes. And it's about, what is it, probably 300 pounds or so. You know, it's not extremely heavy, but it's more than you'd want to try and manhandle out of there yourself. Ah, oh, yeah, it's coming up. Just take a check here, make sure everything's free. Yeah. So what I'm going to do with this is I'm going to back my truck up here and I'm going to put the tailgate down. I'm going to put a couple of timbers under it and I'm going to sit it on the timbers and I'm going to slide this into the back of my pickup truck. Okay, let me get it a little higher first. There it is, 3.0 engine, V6, 2004 Ford Escape, and the CD4E automatic transmission in one piece. And there you go. And that's how that's done. And like I say, if you don't feel confident building yourself something like this, don't. Don't do it. You don't want to drop anything on yourself. But there it is. 